Good morning. This is Beatrice Vivius reporting from St. Lucia Estuary. Ah! Wow. Good morning to you too, sir. Ski boats has been going out since early. Buck is walking around town. No, it's the truth. You can see them. They've, they are there on the ocean. They're fishing. What are you complaining about? Can I please continue with my video now? Where were I? Oh, the guinea fowls walking around the bushbuck, red diker. It's a lovely day. People not f out fishing yet. They don't want to fish. They want to complain that there's no fish. Fishing in the estuary. Nothing major happening yet. We haven't had a breach from the ocean. So no fresh water ca ocean water came in and revived the system a little. Still a beautiful view though. Going to continue a little bit on the boardwalk and see what other friendly guests we can encounter and have conversations with. But did patiently accompany my on my journey to serenity. This is the only meditation where I can find peace with myself. Okay, we pick up with a beautiful view from this point. You can see the water level in the estuary has risen a lot since the last videos I made. But over the last couple of days it receded again. Especially between yesterday afternoon and this morning, there's a huge difference in the water level. We're still waiting for the flood from um, Flozzi Game Reserve to reach us. There's a huge water flow coming this way. Hopefully this evening I can make a video with it being here. I thought it was going to be here last night already. But uh, travel time of water is not that fast. But that investigating nature, I'm a little bit nervous because the injured hyena has been sighted here quite a few times in this area. But that come come terug op. Kom, kom op. There you go, go. Now I feel a little bit more comfortable. Don't find anything ridiculous now. Oh, what beauty. Visually, audibly, and sense, smell. Get investigating nature again. Here's something I like. It's old, really dying. I love to photograph them, especially just after the rain when they act fresh. I don't know what is edible and what's not edible, but they make lovely pictures. Right, but that girl, it's time to go to work. Otherwise, we can't afford all this luxury. Although we're staring at the dead system, it's died, it's not functioning as a history, it's sad. 
But yeah, it's still beautiful, still lovely. Ambiance, everything is just pretty. Man-made man man -made management of the system. We hear the ski boats battling to get across the sandbank in the back. But yeah, it is beautiful. So peaceful. No Julius Malema that wants to jump out of the bush and beat your head in with a pickaxe. Just you, your dog, nature. What's this little critter? Can I focus on it? No, I can't. Sorry, I wanted to show you that, but I couldn't. Interesting observation I just made. But yeah, since I can't identify the call of a harida from a trumpet to a hornbill, I might even not even make the observation. I don't see hippos. Where's all the hippos this morning? Well, it's a couple of days that I've been missing them around here. Just one huge lock drifting up and down. Yeah, the cell phone camera is not strong enough to record that. Just a little bit of observation. This creeper strangling the dragon trees. Dragon trees which is indigenous to the area. Those creepers, I don't know if they're indigenous or not. But anyway, this is what happens when you let nature take care of itself after you've induced human interference damn you i hate you making my name ass like that it wasn't a trumpet or hornbill it's a bloody harida it's worse than a going away bird you know how you cook a harida you take a stone and a harida and you put it in a pot put onions, garlic, spices and everything together top it up with water and cook it and cook it and cook it and cook it some more and eventually when the stone is soft and tender you take the harida out, you throw it away and you eat the stone Seriously, there's nothing in nature that even wants to eat you. Damn it, you screwed up my whole video. Now I look like a fool. Anyway, that will teach me to get back into nature, start learning my stuff again. 12 years out of it is just too long. This is where I need to be. This is what I need to do. This is me. This is my life. Okay, this is the last view. Enjoy your day wherever you are, whoever you are. Thank you for watching. Like, dislike, comment, subscribe. Please guys, get this channel active. To see more videos on a daily basis like this. Thank you.